Now for part E, we're told that we've got these two people, Jess and Tom, and Jess wins when the spinner is an odd number, and Tom wins when it's an even number. And for part E, we've got to work out the probability that Jess wins after two spins. Now to get a win, you've got to score more than or equal to 10 points. So we're really saying that the probability for a win has got to be that the total score after two goes then has got to be greater than or equal to 10. And for Jess to win, that is the numbers have to be odd, then it must mean that the only way you're going to get 10 you can't get more than 10 anyway with odd numbers here in two goes. It must mean that the spinner's got to come up with a five and then another five because five is an odd number and it will give us 10. So we're looking at the probability of getting a five and another five. So it has to be 0 0.20 then multiplied by another 0 0.20. And that's going to give us 0 0.04. Okay?